Okay, so here we've got uh, two rectangles, and we have to use the formula A equals uh, L times W to give the area. And you can see in both of these rectangles that they uh, have decimal numbers. So let's use the formula. So let's write that down. A equals length times width. Okay, so now... In order to use the formulas, all we do is, once we've got the formula, we just substitute into the formula uh, what we know. So I'll write A, because we don't know A yet. A is the area. Now, do we know the length? Well, we do. It's here, 3.4. And do we know the width? We do. It's 2.2. Okay. And just a reminder that these brackets means that it's whatever's in this bracket, times whatever's in this bracket. When you've got brackets right next to each other like this, uh, in between them is an invisible uh, multiplication sign. Okay, so let's keep going. Next step is to carry out this multiplication. So it's probably quite easy to use a calculator for this. So 3.4 times 2.2, 7.48. So 7.48, include the units of measurement. So we're using centimeters. And because it's area, it's squared. OK, so we finished that one. Let's go on to number two. So again, all you do is lead off with the same process. So you write down the formula and substitute into the formula. So. Area equals, we're given the length, so it's 8.35, so multiplied by 2.8, and then we just use our calculator to carry out the our calculation, so 8.35 multiplied by 2.8, that equals 23.38. So write that down, 23.38. Units of measurement is meters, it's area, so it's got to be squared. And that is complete.